Welcome to It's My Biz, the big show for small business. The show that takes an in-depth look at small businesses whose owners have come to us because they want advice on ways to take their businesses to the next level. So, in this episode, we're going to be booking some time at a business based at the Dome in North Riding in the Greater Johannesburg area that provides media and advertising services. It's called Black Market Media, and it handles media budgets for various clients. The business also undertakes negotiations for brands and products and places media across several platforms, including YFM, 5FM, Metro FM, and of course, ETV. It's time to meet the man in the biz beam in this week's show, Tato Sakhaul. How are you doing? I'm very well, thank I you. Did it right? Yes, you did. Fantastic. <laughs> As always, the team that books its own time to give a public airing to their analysis and advice on It's My Biz are Biz Wizards. And they'll be applying all their skills and expertise to see how Tato here can take his business to the next level. First, our operations whiz, Francis Wright. Welcome, Francis. Thank you, Andile. Looking forward to it. Always a pleasure to have you here. And of course, there's our marketing whiz, Mike Said. Welcome to you, Mike. Thank you, Andile. Great to be here with you. There is our financial and legal whiz, Thane Niemand. Welcome, Thane. Thanks, Anelia. A pleasure to be here. Okay, guys, you've been out to see Tato's business, and you're in an excellent position to give us an indication of what your first impressions were. We're going to ask you to give us a rating out of 10, 10 being excellent, one not so great, right? So we're going to start with Francis. Francis, what's your rating for this business? I'm going to give Tato a four. Okay. Everything is there, but it's not scalable, meaning that he can't grow the business with the operations that he has in place at the moment. Mike, your rating, please. I'm going to score the business a four. Everything you're doing so brilliantly, all that strategy, all that marketing you're doing for your clients, unfortunately, you're not doing for yourself. Then your rating, please. Tato has got a business that has got good cash flow. Mm -hmm. He outsources. But unfortunately, although cash flow is important, it is not the only thing that's important. And Tato needs to take responsibility for certain issues in his business. So a six for Tato. Finally, something above five. Tato, I see a little smile on your face. <laughs> How are you feeling so far? I feel good so far. Good. I feel okay. Good. Fantastic. But when the panel, of course, was out at Black Market Media, we also asked Tato what he thought the challenges were that he's facing in his business right now. The challenges that made him want to be here with us on It's My Biz. Tato secured his airtime and stepped straight into our biz booth. Let's take a listen to what he had to say. The challenges facing my business are HR management, the legal side of finance, and employee productivity. But then it was my turn. I really wanted to see for myself how Tato schedules and organizes his business at the Dome in North Riding. Hello. I'm looking for Tato. That's me. Andile from It's My Biz. Tato, Black Market Media. Lots of media, so I, I sense I'm in the right place. You are in the perfectly right place. It's a perfect media agency you want to be in. Right? Yeah, I haven't interrupted anything serious, I hope. No, I'm not interrupting at all. Okay, so this is a busy desk, I can tell. Walk me through what, what it means to run an agency like yours. We pretty much focus on media buying, um, media negotiations, media placements, and we also do media tracking and media management for clients. Okay, so show me what you guys are up to, like right now. Even campaigns that we work on with other, other sister brands and so forth, mm. You see, that's, that's a repositioning. It's, it's, it's the same message to a number of, 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 of different people for the same brand. So these are three different executions, like in fact. It's like a massive television brand, isn't it? Yeah, so massive. It's one of our biggest, in fact. Yeah. Uh, one of our biggest, one of Look our favorites. Look smiling. Yeah. Look smiling. <laughs> okay. So okay. We, we love these guys. So this is the different ways to communicate to people out there, yeah. saying the same message, but in different languages. For instance, in a hip-hop manner, yeah. in a gassy manner, in yeah. a reggae manner, in a feminine yeah. manner. But that's, that's, that's what we're supposed to find, what's supposed to, to, to get right. How many people are involved, start to finish? But we do have, uh, have a lady, her name is Pam. Mm -hmm. She handles all, a lot of the stuff that has to do with outdoor, uh, your print and your press stuff. Mm -hmm. And then I have Quinn as well, cool. handles a lot of the broadcast stuff. So what happens on TV, what happens on radio. We do have a particular campaign mm -hmm. in, 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 for instance, a, a newspaper yeah. and so forth. All the things that we're doing. Uh -huh. We actually keep every Whoa. single one. That's so, another load. <laughs> <laughs> so everything that we actually do, yeah. we make sure that we keep every single copy throughout the whole year. 
inspiring stuff. I'm really impressed with what I see so far. But of course, there's always room for improvement. That's what the show is all about. Thank you very much. We'll be going into some depth about the challenges that Tato is facing in his business. So don't go away.